school district on Long Island will get a good look at anyone who pulls a fire alarm. Its technology could have helped police in Florida identify the Stoneman Douglas High School gunman even sooner. All right, Jim Goldberg has a story from Huntington. Security cameras focused on fire alarm pull stations. The latest pilot program put forth in one Long Island district to keep schools safe. And nothing that we sell or anyone else is going to sell is going to stop an active shooter situation, but we're trying to speed up the process. Florida high school shooter Nicholas Cruz created mass chaos last week after he pulled the fire alarm to interrupt the lockdown protocol. The move caused confusion as students and staff filled the halls, initially thinking it was a drill or a real fire until gunfire erupted. Lee Mandel, CEO of video surveillance company Intralogic Solutions, set up the system in Huntington. He says pull station surveillance can save valuable time while getting rid of guesswork. So if a person activates the pull station, cameras pop up real time so security could determine if it's a credible threat or if it's an actual fire alarm. We've seen that the typical scenario is the person's coming in the building, they either have a mask on, they're covering themselves, or they have a bag or they're carrying something. Huntington School Superintendent James Polanski says dozens of cameras in the district have been repositioned. And we have 4,600 students and over 1,000 staff members in this district, and I take it as, as my responsibility before anything else to make sure that they are safe and secure. Safety and security when seconds matter. In Huntington, Long Island, Jody Goldberg, Fox 5 News.